Naming is very important in your novel. Um, the slaves name themselves every chance they seem to get, or that you give them anyway. Aminata names Christoph frequently. How important is one's name? Well, I think one's name is, is vital. I mean, when you meet somebody and they've met you before and they don't know your name, you know instantly that they don't know your name even though they should. Or if you meet somebody and you don't know their name but you should and you feel terrible because you know, damn it, damn it, what's that person's name? I should know that person's name. You feel bad because like, recognizing somebody's name is like fundamental to sort of recognizing their humanity. If you don't know their name, you just can't go anywhere, can you? Like, it's like you haven't begun the contact until you know somebody's name. And so there's no more efficient way to rob one of one's own history and one's own past than to sort of totally disallow one's name, to just wipe it out and bring this person into the new world and say, by the way, you're going to be Joe. You know, I don't care what you were called in Africa, you're Joe. And if you dare try to use your African name, you know, we'll beat the stuffing out of you, or worse. And so naming is fundamental. And um, the American and the Australian and the New Zealand titles for the novel is Someone Knows My Name, although I don't like it as much as The Book of Negroes. And although it was forced on me, well, the title change was forced on me. I chose that title. Um, it does get to the heart of the loss of name. Mm -hmm. And there's a very important scene in the early part of the novel in which Aminata goes into the hold of a slave vessel and she sees the boy who will later become her husband and she knows his name and she says his name and he's just so gratified to have his name spoken aloud. He says, ah, oh, someone knows my name. Like for a millisecond I feel like a human being again mm -hmm. because someone knows my name and this detestable hole in the slave vessel. Mm -hmm. And so naming is vital, I think, to all of us, certainly to me, and it's, it's vital to Aminata and to her people. And she comes back to that idea when she participates in writing the British military legend that becomes known as the Book of Negroes because she names people. It's an act of repossession. You know, she's naming them in this, in this document.